It's 6.30 a.m. on the fourth day of the occupation, and we start with a Scientology security workout. Remove the flyer. What do you need for this? One, you need to be dressed in black. Two, a badge on your upper arm. Three, handcuffs, a walkie-talkie, a knife, keys, gloves, pepper spray, a phone, and not to forget the LRH 3000 goofy shoes. If you have all that, then you can tear off flyers and be a good Scientology security guard. It's very healthy on the joints. It lubricates the uh, elbows and uh, gives a pep to your step. I also hear it helps to have the uh, LRH 3000s on while doing this. No sporting activity is uh, proper without the LRH 3000s. I also hear it's good for helping warm up your fingers while you're preparing to strum. Musicians everywhere recommend that you absolutely use the ability to remove flyers to warm up your fingers. Lubricates the joints, not just on the elbows. Yes, and reaching up actually gives a nice stretch to the lats. You just have to make sure you do it on both sides though, you know. I hear a lot of people have a lot of muscle imbalances because they overwork the right versus the left. Or, you know, sometimes the left versus the right. And just remember, when you pull, you gotta bring your elbow close to your body to get that nice, deep, deep back exercise. Never can forget those rows. And you gotta make sure to target both the top, mid, and lower parts of your back. Always good to keep a good muscle balance. By the way, without the sunglasses, he doesn't look like Xenu anymore. That confuses me now. The restraining order for Scotty was not from the poodle guy mentioned by DOA. He was mistaken. It was a Scientology security guard, but I don't have any more information at the moment. On day four of the occupation, Danny was served with a restraining order. The incident for the restraining order had occurred on May 9th. The day DOA was swatted for the second time by the LAPD Northeast Division, Sergeant Gomez was responsible for both the swatting and Danny's arrest. This is the video. Scooter Guy claims that Danny made him fall and that Danny threatened him with pepper spray. He neither fell nor did Danny have pepper spray on him. LAPD searched him and found nothing. The original charge was attempted robbery, nothing else. Scooter Guy also claims in the RO that he got back problems from the assault. Danny was not charged with battery or assault. More in this video. You're blocking the way, sir. Uh, uh, hey, 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 hey. Relax! You did that! You did that! I caught that on camera. You tried to run him over, sir. You tried to run him over. You tried to run him over. I have it on video. We have it on video, buddy. I have it on video. You tried to run him over. Guys, I want to end this clip so it's easier to find for the cops. Danny was first arrested for attempted robbery in the incident. Then a hate crime was added. Neither was listed under other court cases in the RO, which is really strange. Because the scooter man had initiated a private person arrest, Danny was held for four days, his shoes were taken from him, and they allegedly disappeared and could not be returned to him. No charges were filed. Danny did not have to appear before a judge. He was simply released. After the incident happened, Danny was the one who reported the LAPD for the assault with the scooter. The LAPD came and arrested Danny without watching any of the many videos. We come back to day four of the occupation. Aja has a lot to do that day, but she took the time to check out the Scientologists' festival. As we can see, the only ones running around at the festival for children are Scientologists, but no children. Which is very good. We don't want to see children there. What you have? Thunder only happens when it's raining. Watch him. Watch William come and close the curtain. Watch. The event. Have you ever seen so many Scientologists at once? It's just free. Oh, I told you. It's okay, honey. God is on my side. God is on my side, Jason. I'm going to get a view. Trust and believe. Oh, hi, honey. How are you? What a surprise. Scooter guy without a scooter or any other assistance. 
Did he claim in the RO that he has such bad back problems and can't walk without help? Hmm, another lie. I want to take his look at this. Good afternoon. Hi, how are you? Move the card and thank you. Isn't that good? God is so good. God is so good. They can try to block me, but you know what? God is always on my side, honey. Know that. Look at the Santos. Hey, Santos. Keep the curtain like that, please. Thank you. Obey your master. Obey your master. Aha. See? The curtain rod is... See, look at the curtain rod. I know, right? I have see... I have see through eyes. Oh, God is so good. God gives me the perfect, perfect shot. Ah, look at, look at God, look at good God is. He keeps. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God. Ah, look at that. Ah, look at, look at. You can close the curtain all you want, honey. God is on my side. God is on my side. Look at that. It's so there's there are no kids though, but it's supposed to be kids song, kids event. There are no kids. Nothing but cars and adults. Nothing but nothing but adults. I don't see kids. Look at that. Nothing but I see adults in uniforms. That's all I see. Where are the kids? Aja has also taken care of Matthew, alias MTK and spoken to him because he is behaving very strangely again. Okay, Matthew, okay, they're looking at you in your camera and you are also drinking in public. You think I am? I know you are. I just saw what you just did right now. He was hiding a can in a brown paper bag. We are not blind. It's not an assumption when my fucking eye saw it. What does it say? What does it say what? The way to happiness. The common sense guy to better leave him. Okay, so, Matthew. Look, see what you see. Not someone. Okay, Matthew, I'm not here. I'm not here to okay. talk. I'm not here to talk about your book. DOA has already made an announcement that he is no longer welcome because he poses a risk to the encampment and the plans associated with it. There have been several situations where he has become overly aggressive. The LAPD came for him because he stepped on a sprinkler. I come here to tell you something. So, so, um, right now you're hindering the protest. Right now, you are damaging. You're damaging the protest. I'm, I'm not worried about your book. I don't really care what your book says, Matthew. I'm coming here with respect to you. With you, um, DOA already talked to you, right? DOA already talked to you. So the way you're behaving right now, the way you're behaving right now, it's damaging. It's damaging the protest right now. Okay. He has said to you, many people have said to you, I have said to you in the past to calm yourself down. I have, I have said to you many times to chill out, calm down. And you come down and you, for a few minutes and then you get back to do, do your, own, your own thing, okay? When did I do that? Okay, in the past, past days. Thank you, yeah, in the past. Okay, so if you are not gonna be respectful, if you are not, if you have intention to damage the protest and hinder, uh, of hindering the protest, and you're not gonna, if, if you're not gonna listen, then I'm gonna kindly ask you uh, that you are the protest. Look what you're doing right now. You're antagonizing the cameras. Okay. Yeah, they're following me with the cameras. Okay, but you, they're, okay, they're following you with the cameras, but you know what? Listen to me, okay, listen, You're listen. Me off, but that's fine. Go ahead. You cannot be drinking in public. You are not, you are not part of the protest anymore. And now you see, you're, you're pretending that you are. Now you're antagonizing, you're antagonizing the cameras right now. I'm antagonizing, that's ridiculous. Arthur. Yeah, you are. That you okay, made, you, I, I'm no longer speaking with you because that's, you that's what I saw. That's what I saw. That's what I now I saw right now. So what were you doing? You're a good person. I'm communicating with them. You're communicating with the camera. Yes. There's people outside. They hear me talking. When I hear them, I talk to them. I am. I'm, I'm doing my own thing. The way to happiness. 
17-1. Look, see what you see, not what someone else tells you. So do you want to go inside? Do you want to join Scientology? You can if you want to. They, they, will, they will be glad to accept you. No, that statement is meant for them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So what do you think from, from the outside? What do you think that that looks like? What you're doing to the cameras? What do you think that that looks like? Their book to them to show their mm -hmm. hypocrisy? Mm -hmm. Yes. See what you see, not yeah. What like listen, I, 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 I feel bad for you. I feel, I feel bad for you. Yeah. All right. Okay. Well, I'm gonna tell you right now. Don't be drinking. Don't associate with us. And you're you leaving your dog by yourself, by the way. Um, just stay away from that. From 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 the protest. Several signs regarding the live streamers have been put up in the camp for information, but Aja still has more to do. Another bull baiter arrives and reacts aggressively to Aja holding a camera for no reason. At the beginning, she doesn't film him at all. How he hasn't been used? Excuse me? I'm walking over there, don't be recording me. I, I don't understand what you're saying. When I'm walking over there, don't be recording me. So this is a public sidewalk, right? I don't care. Okay, so so this is a public sidewalk. So hold on, I said, stay away from me. Stay away from me. Stay away from me. This is a public sidewalk, okay? And I'm asking, this is a public sidewalk. Keep walking. Keep walking. Keep walking. Keep walking. What you gonna do to me if I don't? Okay, I'm asking you not to record. Okay, but this is a sidewalk, though. This is a sidewalk. Fucking sidewalk. Okay, you can ask, but I don't have to abide by what you're saying. No, I don't. I don't. I don't. It's public sidewalk. Public sidewalk. Okay, well you're recording me. It's public sidewalk. Keep walking, keep walking. There's security, there's cameras on the fence pole, on the light poles. Yeah. The public, but if you're recording me on purpose, I need to know why you're recording. No, no. We don't have to. Just keep walking. I wasn't recording you. I was not. I was cleaning the bathroom. I was, okay. You, you want to argue? What's up? You want to argue? Do you want to argue? Well, now I am for my safety. I am for my safety now. I am for my safety now. Keep walking. Take your ass home if you don't want to be recorded. Keep fucking walking then. I didn't try. I'm just, I'm just, no, 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 no. Uh, Danny, I'm a, I'm a grown woman. I know what I'm doing. Danny, I'm a grown woman. I know what I'm doing. Uh, yeah, I know, please. but I just, I pulled. Uh, I know, please. I know, like, no, listen, I know, I know, I know, but listen, I'm from the streets, and when someone disrespect me like that, don't expect respect back. That's just how it is. You know what I mean? Anyway, let me continue what I was going to do. Yesterday was day one of the Joey V. Williams Streets LA hearing. Joey wanted a temporary restraining order against William months ago, which was denied. He still wants a hearing and to represent himself. This is the day the papers were served on William. Temporary restraining order. Oh Hi, I you. Notice of court hearing. Where'd that come from? Joey! Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Self-represented, listen to this. Oh, oh God. Joey is filing, let's see he's gone. Wait, does he legally have to say you've been served? Well, yeah. What the hell? A restraining a order. Oh, he's gonna... I'm going to... Joe, we want a restraining order? He he just ran like David <laughs> yeah, right. He's not too much trouble. I, he's already been in jail over this. Stay get away. Get out of here. The case was dismissed, William. My case... My whole case was dismissed. My case was your behavior. You created that. Your PPA you He walks up to you. You don't follow him. Denial or other personal conduct, stay away orders. I'd requested in. <laughs> it's so funny. So he's asking, he needs a hearing as to a relief that the court, the court already denied him and he wants a hearing anyway. Oh, so he's asking for a protection of his toy dog, the pill and breed, the kismet, who is tri colored well, male. You, this I is probably that. about his dog. When we say save that dog. Matt. Wait, he, he wants a restraining order for his dog? What? I got I got a picture of the dog. Uh, look, look how adorable Will looks. I'll help you. He's a great dog. It's really heavy. It's okay. I carried a lot. Good. I'm a good kid. 
Yeah, put Solomon to work. Great Solomon. Great Solomon. <laughs> <laughs> so tomorrow, then I'll be free. Then tomorrow, I can't say it right now, but then tomorrow, we get to have my sister. I've been silent for Yeah, do you get to like walk out right behind him just talking shit? I get, I get to, I could, or, I mean, I'm just. I think you should. He's must talking about my son. I don't forget that. And so I'm gonna make a thing about <laughs> They had that David Miscavige thing here today. I didn't know that. Yeah, it's crazy. Yeah. Well, I said something. I'm here this moment. I was like, oh, are you here for Valerie Davis? And he's like, no, I'm here for school. So I was like, oh, I didn't even get that. Didn't get that. And he told me, he's like, I got here. He's like, I've been here since 7 o'clock. Like, since 7? I'm like, what are you doing here? It's 7 o'clock in the morning. So, so where are you doing tonight? Seeing the blue building tonight? Wow. Overnight? You and yes, you and Jeff. I'll say no. <laughs> Nobody forgot about you saying they all saying. they all said it on my chat. Years old. Okay. That's the age. Is, what the age got to do with it? I know it makes no sense. You know that. Do you see that? Sense. There's an older lady that was saying there last night. Oh. Old man. She's not 49. She said she's in her 60s. That's that's on top. 60. Oh. Then it starts getting better. Scientology is increasingly becoming a movie and photo set. More and more people come by to film or take photos there. Fuckface, do you remember? I remember. And I know where the cupcake is. Whoop. Let's go. Fuck, okay. Is that good? I got like a hand. Uh, that's, uh, Rib Guy. Hey, so, just so you know, if you got filmed any of that, we're not, we're against Scientology as well. We're, we're making a little funny video about our friend who, like, like, he got his mind, he got his memories erased by the cult of Scientology. And, like, we're just, like, having, it's like a Dude, birthday video. Dude, I for fucking love it. I think okay. it's hilarious. Okay, cool. I, I, don't, I don't think anything of it. I fucking think it's hilarious. I just don't want it to be, like, we're, like, si no, like no. Scientologists in the wild or something. No, dude, honestly, the Megaphone gods have blessed me today with free content, so. Yes. Hell yeah. Okay, bye. The only church worth following is the Church of the Megaphone. <laughs>